to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. So in today's video, I'm bringing you newest collection by Shandra Kai. They've come out with a trio, an eyeshadow trio and few lippies. So I picked them up and I'm going to be showing you just first impressions and a quick wash of color and look at talking about these products. If this is first time here, my name is Gigi. Thank you so, so much for being on my channel. I hope you stay, subscribe for more. Click that red button below and without further ado, let's start. All right, friends, so as I mentioned, this is Shanta Guy's newest full collection. They've come out with um, eyeshadow trio and uh, three lipsticks. They are cool. Lipsticks are called uh, lip bells. So they did come up with three shades. I picked up two of them. So we're going to be doing this little makeup look very, very quick and subtle. But before we go ahead and, um, you know, jump into the tutorial, I did wanted to talk about um, the collection and the brand. First of all, I love this brand. I love uh, what is behind it. Uh, Sylvie, the owner, it is very passionate about animals and preserving animals. The proceeds of this collection is going towards preserving Africans walk for giants. So actually, she said on a little clip, I, I watched her, she said that she walked with elephants down that walk and she felt really um, just wanting to preserve that walk that the giants do um, every day. So due to Africans rapidly growing a population, there has been a lot of, you know, just building roads and uh, towns and whatnot. So this collection, uh, some of the proceeds are gonna go to preserve that space for um, the walk for giants so I think um, everything about that it is a uh, very beautiful so now let's talk about the eyeshadow palette it is an amazing and exclusive and a very very luxurious feeling the packaging is very pretty I can't do too much of a close-up because unfortunately one of my shades um, it came really mashed and I am uh, so sad about it so this one is broken I am very surprised because that package was like this effect. It was super protected. I don't know how uh, this happened. The other two shades are intact, but this one is uh, very broken. So I, I don't want to make a mess. I do want to try to press it back in the pan, but um, I was still able to use it. It is beautiful it is a beautiful collection i think this is gonna be for the sophisticated woman for someone on the go or someone that has uh, that wants just a wash of color you know like nothing too intense because the shades are just so so subtle they are beautiful they're cool toned and i really like it i think it's very very special the quality of the product you can tell um, it is not extremely pigmented at all so if you're expecting pigmentation it is not what you're gonna get from these eyeshadows they're just a very very subtle so now when it comes to the lipsticks they are beautiful you guys a beautiful packaging everything about it I love the shade that I'm wearing which is tamarind this is gonna be more of your lipstick um, lipstick lip balm hybrid so it's gonna be really really comfortable not extremely shiny but at the same time very very easy to reapply it's not a lipstick that you need to be super precise and have you know a lip liner or anything like that so i really appreciate that about the lipsticks because i am super low maintenance when it comes to that if i didn't mention the trio retails for 75 and the lipids uh, retail for 48 dollars friends now let's jump into the tutorial portion of the collection I did apply both on my eyes and my cheeks so you're gonna be able to see that using the palette and then we're gonna jump into my final thoughts all right friends so let's get started and today we're gonna be talking all about new Shantakai collection they've come out with this walk for giants safari collection this is what the trio well this is what the box looks like so sad to report that my palette, one of the shades came broken, um, but I'll show you pictures of what this looks like up close, but these are the shades in here and these are the elephants that are embossed on the little palette. Oh, so, so sad. So these, the shade that um, came broken is the golden shade. I'm gonna do swatches in so this is that shade. Then you have the copper tone. 
the cheese in a more red and then a more cool tone so these are the shades in the palette and so the collection as uh, supports our longtime partner a space for giants and their vital work protecting Africa's elephants and their landscape uh, that they depend on. I wanted to do something very very soft you know since this shade is broken I don't even know where I go from here but I think I'm gonna take the coolest tone shade and I'm gonna run that all over um, my crease first. And this is a really, really delicate and soft shade. And then I'm gonna apply that golden shade that broke all over my lid. So this is gonna be your really soft and sophisticated eye. Just using those two shades, a very pretty. Um, I'm going to now move to this side and I'm gonna take the same transition shade and I'm gonna do that all over my crease. And then I'm going to take a copper tone and I'm going to apply that all over my lid. And this shade is very, very soft, but you are able to build it up. I love these copper tones. I find them very flattering to a lot of complexions. And then I'm gonna take the gold and I'm gonna put that a little bit in my inner corner. And these shades are all so, so subtle and um, as I mentioned, just really sophisticated uh, for something very quick and on the go. I'm going to run that crease shade, the cool tone shade on both my lower lash. I did wanted to use my palette as a blush and as a highlighter so I am going to take the middle shade and I'm going to use it as a blush And it is a really dark shade, so you have to be really light-handed. So I'm just picking up a little bit of it, and it is a beautiful, beautiful shade. I like it. And then I am going to take the golden shade, and I'm going to try to use it as a highlighter. I don't know if um, it'll work. But it's just uh, so, so natural, so it's actually pretty. But only if you like natural highlighters. 
So I did went ahead and did a little bit of brown liner and I applied mascara and I did the same brown liner for my lower lash. So now we're gonna go ahead and try the two lipids that I got. I got the shade Acacia and I got a Tamarind. Which Tamarind, as a side note, is actually a fruit. We have it back home, I'm from Colombia and it is a delicious delicious fruit and it is the shade of the compact so i love i love the detail on these guys the compact is really pretty so we're gonna start off swatching acacia so beautiful shade and then let's do tamarind. More of your red brown tone. This is Acacia. Okay, now let's do tamarind. And this is tamarind. Alrighty, friends. So as I mentioned before, I really like this collection. I feel like the message behind the collection and the brand itself, it is amazing. And I love that. I love uh, that beauty brands are really taking on to special tasks and a special missions because it is truly a mission i love how shandokai has different organizations where they donate tours um to preserve animals and things like that so i love that about the brand um talking about the products i love the lip product dish this color is very beautiful i love it tamarind as i said in spanish is tamarindo and i love tamarindo it is a super sour fruit and if i can find a picture i'll pop it up there just uh, just for you to see it. it is a stunning and delicious juice you can get from that fruit so whenever i saw that name tamarind i'm like oh my god i need tamarind i need tamarind in my life so i love this shade I think it's super flattering in a ton of skin tones. So other than that, I really like the collection. I think uh, this is going to be for someone that, again, is just a woman on the go that is not looking for a lot of pigmentation, but just being a super classy. You know, of course, you're paying for the experience of the luxury of the brand. You're paying a lot for the brand, not for like the product itself. You know what I mean? So. Anyways, those were my facts. Let me know in the comments down below what do you think of this collection? Do you like it? What do you think? I would love to know your thoughts and opinion. Did you pick it up? What do you think? Thank you so, so much, my friends, for your love and support. Do not forget to share, like, and subscribe, and I'm gonna catch you in my next one. Bye.